My name is Tom Mattingly. I am the flotilla commander for the Outer Banks Flotilla of the United States Coast Guard Auxiliary. The Coast Guard Auxiliary exists really for the main reason is our mission is promote boating safety. Here on the Outer Banks though, we have a secondary mission that's just about as important as supporting the air station Elizabeth City. When pilots come into the Coast Guard, they typically train with the United States Navy down in Pensacola. They learn how to fly the helicopter, same helicopter the Navy flies, they call it the Seahawk, the Coast Guard calls it the Jayhawk. They're not taught what they're supposed to be doing with those helicopters once they get to an air station. That's where we come in. Um, we are one of a bunch of training partners for the air station. They like us for one very simple reason. We are less than five minutes from the runway. So they get up in the air and they're out over the Albemarle Sound and they start working. A couple of years ago, the air station estimated that we saved the Coast Guard about one and a half million dollars on just fuel. You know, they'd have to fly up to Cape May or down to Wilmington to work with Coast Guard vessels. And so because of the presence of the auxiliary able to take these training missions, we free up the Coast Guard boat stations to do what they're supposed to do. We promote boating safety in a number of different ways. Probably the most recognizable aspect of what we do is our boating safety classes. We typically do six to nine a year. Uh, they're either one day classes, uh, the Boat America program, Twice a year, we run what we call the boating safety and seamanship. It's kind of the graduate level course. We teach all kinds of different things in that. It's typically done over six nights, Southern Shores of the Volunteer Fire Department up there. That's probably the thing we're most known for, but beyond that, we also do vessel safety checks here all down the beach. We check off that they've got everything on that boat that they're supposed to have. They pass inspection, we award them a U.S. Coast Guard Auxiliary Vessel Safety Check decal that they put on the boat. We do a lot of fun events to, to promote who we are and the boating safety message. We have the Seafood Festival. We are going to be in Mike Kelly's St. Patrick's Day Parade with this boat in a few weeks. We haul it out of the water and we haul it down and give kids stuff and all. So we do a number of events like that throughout the year. We also go into the schools quite frequently. Next week, in fact, we start, we're going into six elementary schools here on the beach and we teach a kind of a modified boating safety class for those kids. But the biggest thing I think people need to know about the Outer Banks Flotilla is that we serve this community, all right? We do everything here. Our operating area is from where we're standing right now to the south tip of Roanoke Island. So everything we do is for the Outer Banks and it's all community service. And that's one of the main reasons most of us joined. We like being on the water, we like boating safety, we like being on boats, but we also all acknowledge that we're serving our community, not something else. Everything we do here stays here. Wear your life jacket. Have your, your personal flotation device with you. 80% of the people that die in the water out there, they were not wearing a life jacket. We encourage everyone to have a radio, you know, a VHF radio on their boat, either a handheld version or something mounted. And most boaters here do. Have a way to communicate when you're out in your boat. If you're gonna be out for a long time, just tell a neighbor, hey, we're going out. I'm probably gonna be out all day. So basically, if you don't see me back here by nightfall, Call somebody, we're in trouble. If what we're doing sounds like fun, the probably the best way to get a hold of us is go to our website and you can find it by Googling CGAUX OBX. Your first hit will come up, will be our website. You can contact us, the email will come to me. We'll reach out and we'll talk to you more about joining the auxiliary. We're a fun bunch of people, we like to have fun.